G'day everyone, Count Lurchalot here and the time has come for me to react to Food Battle 2023. Oh, this is a video that I know a lot of classic Smosh fans have been excited for and having watched many food battles now myself, I gotta say my excitement for this just got higher and higher the more I had to wait and the more food battles I watched. Like I said, I haven't finished the food battle series as seen in my reaction series, but I'm doing this one anyway because I just gotta see it. I was actually advised on Twitter not to watch this before I'd finished the other food battles, but I'm just very excited for this because it's gonna be the return of both Ian's mom and Stevie to a smosh skit, and I've been told by other subscribers that this is a very good battle, so just gives me more reason to watch it. Now, shut up, Lurch. Time to watch the video. Ah, <laughs> uh, the classic intro as always, and what are they eating this time? Oh yeah, that's a very good dictionary. SHUT UP! Well, that's not too bad. He'd be consuming knowledge. He'd be getting smarter. And Ian is back! Well, he was always in Smosh, so it's Anthony who's back, really. I wonder if they're going to acknowledge Anthony's absence, or how they haven't had a food battle since 2016. Happy anniversary, babe. Oh, no, I can't that's... it's already been seven years. Know, yeah. It's crazy. Well, yeah, they have acknowledged seven years, and oh, that's nice. It's good to see Ian's got a girlfriend or a, a partner. I'm just going to go with partner. I don't know what their relationship is. Hey. Did I ever tell you about the day that I met you? No. Well, me and my best friend Anthony had just finished this thing called food battle. Uh -huh. I used my food to kill him, he used his food to kill me, <laughs> sometimes we accidentally killed ourselves, I got yeah. to switch with the cat as you probably know, yada yada yada. It doesn't matter. <laughs> what does matter is that I found something very special that day, and I want you to have it. Aww. Ugh. What, gum? My lucky gum. Oh. Oh. Thanks. Yeah. Oh, let me go get your anniversary gift. I forgot I left it in the car. Oh, that's <laughs> nice. And she didn't react as badly as his girlfriend from Ghostmates, thankfully. Still haven't seen it, but I know she wasn't happy about the roommate proposal. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what's in there. Anthony? You'll never guess. Oh. Anthony. <laughs> Anthony. Whoa! Shit! She's dead! No! Oh, no. No. Anthony's gonna be in the trunk though, I bet. No, no uh, just her no. shoes. The, the rest of her have been obliterated. <laughs> oh, they were married. Good for them. My beautiful wife. She's dead now. Ian. Uh oh, here it comes. It's been seven years since the last food battle. But yeah. I finally have what I need to defeat your stupid pink frosted sprinkled donut. Yeah. <laughs> Anthony, I can't do food battle right now. My well, wife just died. That's fair. I need time to mourn. Well, that's fair. Uh, oh, okay, quick I'm morning. done. Okay. All right, you're never gonna defeat my new favorite food, <laughs> baguettes. Yeah, and that's actually a funny callback to an earlier video where they use their food to cut a baguette. That's actually a great callback. A long, narrow loaf of French bread that. <laughs> oh my God. If you think your baguette could do more everyday tasks than my pink frosted sprinkled donut, yeah, the then classics. you're going down, penis pretzel! <laughs> Such great callback humor, and we've seen that title card before. <laughs> Let's see if your food can be a hammer. Okay. <laughs> I'm guessing it's... is it gonna work? <laughs> hey, it still kind of worked because he hurt himself. <laughs> I bet there's something real good in here. hi -ya! Yeah, the donut works, <laughs> of course. What? Well, he's been stalking them for the last seven years, I'm guessing. Yep, he's been stalking them. Whoa. Oh my god, major stalking. My wife. What the? Huh? What? He's been stalking no. you. <gasps> He's been stalking you. That's it. Let's see if your pink it. frosted turd can be a therapist. What? Yeah, I think that'd be good for both of us. Uh huh. Uh huh. <gasps> She's here. Uh huh? Yeah. Hey, mom. Ian's mom. Ian's mom. It's so good to see her again. Hello, Ian's mom. To my therapist, and they thought it'd be a good idea if I stood up for myself from time to time. That's so, fair. So no, I won't clean my room. <laughs> <laughs> You'll do it now, you impotent cuck. 
Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Again, this is pretty much one of the main reasons I just had to watch this battle because oh, the return of Ian's mum is such a spectacular thing to behold. Definitely one of the best characters in Smosh, which is ironic because I literally saw an interview with Ian and Anthony. It was that uh, autocomplete interview. They're like, he's like, my mom, she's not an actress. In fact, she hates acting. And yet she manages to be one of the best characters in this show. Oh. But granted, that's just probably- well, that's probably where Ian got his natural comedic talent from. His mum. Well, Anthony's got the advantage here because he's not using his baguette to stand up to Ian's mum, so... Yeah, that's actually probably the smart thing here. Baguette? Yeah? Is it weird if I can't stop thinking about how birds have just one hole for everything? Oh! Okay. I don't... Okay. I'll take that as a no. Well, at least it worked. Good on you, Baggett. You helped Anthony. Maybe I should get a Baggett now for my own therapy. Nah, 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 I think I'm good. I'm, I'm good. Why are you- <laughs> Oh, I get it, because he was forced to clean his room. He's a maid! Wearing that? The outfit stays on until Ian- <gasps> Oh, I remember them mentioning this. She's, uh, in my last stream, one of my subscribers mentioned that you can see- uh, Ian's dad in the background. I'm guessing that man in the background is Ian's dad, though. I don't know if you can see it based on where my camera is. Guess I'll find out when I'm doing the editing. If so, well, that's on me. But, hello Ian's dad, it's great you're a part of this too, but let's face it, Ian's mum is the real star. Food Battle 23, featuring the great Ian's mum, whose name I do know is Sharon, but come on, we all call her Ian's mum. Yeah, I was afraid you wouldn't be able to see Ian's dad based on where I put my, uh, face, but I've moved myself up. There he is, and now I'm gonna move myself back down. Okay, good to go. Ian cleans his room. Yeah! Um, oh, let's just do an item to clean my room thing. <laughs> That's <Yeah>. fair. <laughs> Again, usually Ian's the one I enjoy more because he's the funny one, but damn, Anthony is savage in these battles, and he plays fair, so yeah, I tend to be on Anthony's side for these. Okay, fine! <laughs> Let's just do this one. Yeah! I, what? I can't see. What does it say? It says, <laughs> uh, saw. <laughs> hmm. Okay, I guess Anthony is cheating in this instance because he wasn't being honest. Bad, Anthony. Bad! I wonder if my baguette will be able to chop this pre-sliced bread. Mm. Baguette? Yeah! <laughs> oh my god, it worked! Hmm. Looks like Anthony's taking a page out of Ian's book. Cheater! Nah, he's earned it. Okay, donut. I got my arm stuck on- Okay, I didn't need to see that. Let's see how well the donut works to be a saw. The saw my whole arm off! <laughs> oh, he's 127 houring this. That that got dark quickly. This is so much fun! Really? Oh. You had to 127 oh hour this? Oh my god, it worked! Did it though? <clears throat> yeah. Wow, yep. He's literally got the bandage where he put it back on, and I'm guessing he cleaned his room now, or he's just ignoring his mom. Stupid mom. <laughs> Let's see if your bread can rise to this occasion. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get oh. it. Rise. How about President of the United States? Ooh, Ooh. okay. Um, uh, who do I vote for? Hmm. Who should I vote? Oh, wait. I'm Australian. I can't vote. Never mind. Mr. President, what should we do about the housing crisis? <laughs> Hello? Yeah, he's not helping. He's <sighs> not doing anything. What can you expect? It's a donut. Oh my god, Mr. President, it's so nice to meet you. My name's Anthony Padilla. <laughs> Padilla, like tortilla? Uh. Huh? What? Uh. Oh. oh, what the f***? That's not just... Mexican! Yeah, that's racist! It is still funny, though, that Anthony's won that round there, because I'm guessing that's a jab at the President of the United States themselves, but... Well, uh, anyway, I don't even know why I paused here, but that was funny. <laughs> this is turning out to be a great battle. Really great. Honestly, again, I keep commenting on how Smosh now feels like Anthony never left. Well, this feels like they made a just... Well, again, I haven't seen Food Battle 2016, but I'm guessing this feels like it just was immediately made right the year after. It doesn't even feel like seven years has passed. 
let's get let's continue now. Wow, I'm not even halfway through this, but hey, we've been waiting for this. I don't blame them for making it as long as they could. <laughs> At least he got back. Whoa, he's had a tough time. Very tough time. <laughs> Ooh, how about a Pokeball? <gasps> yes, Pokemon reference. I love the Pokemon reference. I wonder what they're going to catch, though. <gasps> Ooh, a hot chick. Oh. Bikini Girl, a boob-type Pokemon. What? Oh. Bikini Girl. Okay, Bikini Girl, gotcha. A boob-type Pokemon. Boob Typically used by juvenile incels for clickbait by new. Mm, that's true. You're mine. Whoa. Yeah. Hey, it worked! <laughs> I don't think it actually- No, oh, it worked! That's cool! Yeah! Yeah! Okay, I think he deserved- Oh my god! Is he going to catch Ian's mom? If so, Anthony's- If Anthony catches Ian's mom, he's getting the better Pokemon, and I love what she's raising. Raising a Thomas! Oh my god, again! The jokes with this woman are the best! <laughs> I wonder if he has a Pokedex for her. I wonder what it'll say for Ian's mum. Prepare to be mine. No Pokedex? Ian's mom. Hey -ya! <gasps> oh no. <laughs> it's not the first time Let's she's done do... that. Two things. One, I'm not actually surprised that Anthony didn't manage to catch Ian's mum. I mean, Ian's mum is essentially a legendary. And two. Uh, I'm actually a bit disappointed we didn't get a Pokedex, uh, description on her. I mean, I think that would have been hilarious. I wonder what would have been said, like, Ian's mum, extremely powerful Pokemon, or Ian's mum, extremely mean mother who makes Ian do whatever she wants, or something like that. Okay, what crazy thing are you gonna do next? Oh, a breast milk pump. What? Why would you want to do that? Good question. Oh, yeah. Ooh, gross. Icky. Mm. Um, let's do an object that can be used to beat somebody into unconsciousness. That's yes. fair. Oh, no. Is this where they're going to bring in Stevie? Dang it. All right, Baguette. Let's knock this one out of the park. <laughs> what a lovely day. Yep, it's Stevie. Cody and Anthony want to hang out with me later. Mm. <laughs> yeah. I oh, my God. <laughs> Oh. oh my god, Stevie, are you okay? You know, I did predict that he'd be in here to be abused by one of their weird shenanigans. Guess I was right. <laughs> yeah, I think he's dead. It worked! Yeah. <laughs> Who's Ian gonna beat up then? Anthony doesn't know it, but I'm gonna use someone else to fight my battles. <sighs> and again, always the cheater and... Yeah, I think Ian's just gonna beat up Stevie as well. Poor Stevie, he faces a lot of abuse from them. Take that gnarly lady loose! Okay. Go, Bikini Girl! Oh, I see. No, she's just gonna run away a bit, though. Oh. Okay, Bikini Girl. Oh, Knock that dear. guy in. Oh! <laughs> He's still getting puked on by the woman, but thank God Stevie wasn't hurt. <sighs> and you see, Ian, that is what you get for cheating and not fighting your own battles. Thank God Stevie uh, didn't get beaten up for a second time, though. I think one beat up per video is enough. But hey, for all we know, he's probably going to come back and get beat up again because... Uh, that's, that's poor Stevie's life. It's good to see him again, though. Really good. Well, Stevie got beat up by Anthony, but he didn't get beat up by Ian. That's good, but what crazy thing are they going to do next? And I still think they're going to do something else to beat up poor Stevie because they're sadistic in that way. Right, let's finish this once and for all. Okay. How about, uh, parachutes? Oh, jeez. This is going to result in the death of one of them. I just know it. Or maybe this is going to be a crazy situation where they both survive. Oh, jeez. That's not exactly high up enough to use a parachute. But, no, I bet what's going to happen is one of them's going to jump, the other won't. And whoever doesn't jump wins because it's not about who wins the most rounds. It's about who survives. You know only one of us is leaving here alive, right? Mm. And that person is gonna be me, cause my donut's gonna win, and you're gonna die! Probably, cause I you won't we'll jump. I guess we'll see about that. <laughs> Maybe don't eat your parachute. I guess we 
Well. <laughs> yeah, Anthony, maybe don't eat your parachute. <laughs> okay. Again, Ian, you really need to play a villain in a horror movie. Knew it. Ian's not even going to jump. Knew it. Absolutely knew it. Yep, I knew it. Ian's not even going to jump. Cheater! But, for all we know, the baguette will be a parachute, even though it's falling apart. Oh, Anthony! You might want to check your parachute! Oh! Oh! oh my God. It wasn't breaking apart, he snipped it apart. That's fair. I have too much momentum! I can't stop Just running! Stop! <laughs> well, I guess Ian wins this one. <laughs> Why am I not surprised, though? Well, I guess it's over. <laughs> or maybe Anthony's not dead and he's just faking it. Wouldn't be the first time. And it's good they brought the commentator back too. You just won Food Rattle 2023! Yeah! I don't think so. Just like a phoenix! <laughs> he'll rise again! That's from Tenacious D. No! No! Yep! <laughs> oh god! That's not Anthony would make a decent horror villain too. Possible. Yeah, it oh, is. Oh, it is. I used your lucky gum to stick to the wall. Yeah. I'm my way back up. <laughs> no. <laughs> that must be some sticky gum. Oh my god. Climb up, Spider-Man or oh, Man but Spider. How? My wife was holding on to that gum and she died in the explosion. Oh, 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 oh. I know. I bet an M Night Shyamalan level twist is coming. Anthony was the wife the whole time. <laughs> That's just my prediction anyway, and if so, it is uh, probably a bit of an obvious prediction. I'm amazed I didn't come up with it sooner. Anthony was the wife, that is my guess. I am probably right, and I am probably an idiot for not thinking of it sooner. Think about it, Ian. Think back to what happened after we finished the last food battle. Huh, this is probably what that Twitter user said by watch all of them first. I'm now gonna get a spoiler. What is the spoiler? Let's see. We're gonna live. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's nice. Again, major spoiler Whoa, for me, but who cares? Perfectly good gum on the ground. Oh, ew. Oh nice. my god, okay. That's nasty. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> yeah, okay, I was right. Anthony was the wife. Whoa, who are you? I'm Antha. Uh <clears throat> Bree. <laughs> Antha Bree? That's a pretty name. Say, do you want to be my girlfriend? Oh. Yes. <laughs> I guess they're not going to explain how Anthony has shrunk because he's 5'11, Ian's only 5'8, but hey, whatever. Suspension of disbelief. Are you really that stupid? With, Are you sh with it? Yeah, Ian really is that stupid. He's done stupider things in these videos. We had all those things. That we had sex. <laughs> yep. <laughs> but how did you duct tape in an empty Gatorade bottle? <laughs> <laughs> you always knew how to commit to a bit, you son of a bitch. You know, this reminds me a lot of the opening from Dumb and Dumber 2 where Lloyd reveals he's been pretending to be insane for 20 years and he's like, Gotcha! You've been faking for 20 years? Yep. That's awesome! That's what this is giving me. Like, yeah, Anthony's been tricking Ian for seven years, but a Ian's response, awesome! You really know how to commit to a bit. And I love comedy like that, just gotta say. Now I'm left wondering if there will be a victor for this one, but I honestly don't care because this has been great all around, and I checked the credits before uh, continuing this bit, and yeah, Ian's mum is literally credited as Ian mu Ian's mum, but hey. That's what we all know her as, even if we do know what her real name is. But anyway, let's continue. Bring it in! Yeah! <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, jeez! Oh, Yo, Scissoroo! That's oh, fair. Dead now, bitch! <laughs> Damn. Okay. Well, that was unexpected. I should have remembered those scissors, though. That's on me. Uh, Ian! You've yep, just won over now. 2023! What are you gonna do? <laughs> Oh! 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 <laughs> the old uh, anyway, uh, you just want. Oh, 
I thought it was going to be like that one where the commentator died and Anthony couldn't officially win, but... Eh. For the battle 2023, what are you going to do now? Yeah. Please, please say you're going to take me to the hospital. Please. I'm going to go to Disneyland. Oh, call back oh. to the very first Disneyland? one. Can I come? Hell yeah. At least he's letting him come this time. <laughs> oh, God, that's great. He's Man, dead, I think. So much fun, are you? <laughs> <laughs> hey there, kids. <sighs> it's Bo Barney. Do you even know who I am anymore? <laughs> and they're doing the Barney the Dinosaur bit again. That's great. Well, I gotta say, that was a fantastic video and well worth the wait. And honestly, now I do regret a bit that I didn't finish all the original food battles first. But hey, this one was still brilliant and I absolutely loved it and... I'm not surprised that Ian won because he won quite a bit from the ones I have seen, especially through cheating. And hey, he did that again, so really feels like a classic food battle. It was great to see Stevie and Ian's mum again. And hey, and it just occurred to me, they can use the whole Anthony disguising himself as Ian's uh, girlfriend for seven years to explain the fact why Anthony's been missing for seven years. I know, really, it was because Anthony left Smosh and now he's back, but hey... They've got a reason for why he's been gone for so long, because he was pretending to be Ian's girlfriend. <laughs> so yeah, great video overall. I really, really loved it. And oh, this is just more proof that Smosh are back and they are absolutely kings of comedy. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. And if there's any video you'd like me to react to, please leave it in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Bye.